Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. This time we're doing a little 4K haul. Well, there's one Blu-ray, but it's 99.9% .9 4Ks, baby. Um, so yeah, I I don't have too many 4Ks in comparison to the rest of my collection, but I just got a new like um, surround sound. Not well, it's a sound bar with um, like Dolby Atmos and like rear speakers and stuff. So you know what? I want to get some more movies with Dolby Atmos just to kind of test it out. So, um, I had a bunch of video games I didn't really want anymore. Well, I kind of just went through my whole collection and got, like, a whole bin of video games. Took that to a local store called Disc Replay. Um, I took cash. It was, like, a lot more credit, but I just took the cash anyways because I, um, wanted some cash on me. Um, but I did spend, like, half the cash on 4Ks. But they had a pretty good deal. So they had buy three, get three free, which is actually a really nice deal. Um, and their prices weren't too bad. Um, their Blu-rays are very, priced very nice, so they're usually, like, between $5.99 and, like, $7.99, and then you add that with the buy three, get three free, you can get some pretty good deals there, but, um, I've since moved twice, each time farther away from there, so, because I used to live, like, 20, 30 minutes, now I live, like, 40 to 50 minutes away from there, so it's not really easy to just pop in, um, so yeah, let's just get into this and quit my rambling. There is one box set I got because box sets don't count for the buy three, get three free. So there's one box set. So I have that in the middle. So we're going to do six, the box set, and then six more because I got two of the buy three, get threes. So first up we have, now funnily enough, I just said most of their Blu-rays are priced $5.99 to like $7.99. This is one of the, you, you, you can usually tell, they, 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 they mark up some movies like, because this is more of a harder to find movie. So this one was $9.99. But it's Holy Man and Gone Fishing. So Gone Fishing, my dad used to have taped on VHS. I remember watching it and liking it. Um, it's a movie I've not seen in a very long time, so I've been wanting to watch it again. And then Holy Man, I actually watched someone on YouTube who mentioned this was a really underrated Eddie Murphy movie. And I'd never seen it before, so I figured I'd check that out too. Seen this, both of them there in one pack? Figured why not. So yeah, there you go. So next up, so now we're going to get into the 4Ks. First up we have Skull Island. Kong Skull Island, my bad. So I have, I think I, I'm going to be completely honest, I don't remember if I've seen this or not. Um, I think I've seen this, because I know I've seen Godzilla, and then I've not seen Godzilla vs. Kong. But I think I've seen this, I'm not 100% sure though. But anyways, I have it now on 4K. Then we have Godzilla vs. Kong, which was $14.99 as you can see. Nice slip cover. I think this is, oh, a few of these have slip covers. Um, so yeah, Godzilla vs. Kong, The Expendables. By the way, I think it was $80 and some change for all of these. So, because I also, oh, I also had, um, points there. You get points for trading stuff in or buying stuff. So I had a, I used my points and I got a 20% off coupon. So I think it came out to like a hundred and something, but I, with my 20% off, it was like 80 something, like low 80s, I think. So yeah, anyways, The Expendables. Do, 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 do. So yeah, not sure if a lot of these are good 4Ks or not. I kind of just wanted to get, got a bunch of random stuff. Um, they didn't have a, a huge selection of 4Ks, especially compared to their Blu-rays and DVDs. So I kind of had it to be a, get a little bit of not entirely stuff I would normally get if they had a better better options. But yeah, the Expendables too. Um, I don't the first Expendables is okay. I actually really like the second one, but then again, I'm a big Sean Claude Van Damme fan, and this was kind of like. I don't want to say his comeback, but like I think it was one of his first movies that went into theaters in a long while. Um, he's awesome in it. Expendables 3, which I actually just watched this recently for the first time because uh, I had the DVD of it. Um, so this is definitely an upgrade. Um, it was it was okay. I probably I don't really remember the first one a lot, but I think I'd probably put it higher than the first one. I'm not sure on that though, but I still definitely like definitely like the second one more. I don't know. I like how I'm reviewing every one of these movies. <laughs> So those are the first six I got for the buy three, get three free. And then this is the box that I got, the Daniel Craig 4K collection, which was $34.99. But then I got 20% off that, so whatever that is, I don't know. Um, so yeah. It's all in one big box. They had another one there, um, which is weird because they had this was $35. They had one there that was just his first four movies, so it did not count No Time to Die. And it was like thirty nine ninety nine, but it had like the four Ks and the Blu rays in two separate cases. Where this one had some all in one, um, 
like this, so which is interesting. Um, I don't mind it either way, so yeah. Interested? I still have not seen No Time to Die. I actually have No Time to Die already on 4K. Do I have Spectre? I don't think I have Spectre actually, because I have Casino Royale, Quantum of Solace, and Skyfall in like one Blu-ray set, and then I don't think I have Spectre, and then I have No Time to Die on 4K, which I still have not watched. Yeah, and I'm a big James Bond fan. I've been a big fan of James Bond for a long time. Um, do, 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 do. Then we have Escape Plan. So this is starting the next buy three, get three free. Let's just put these right here. There we go. That's better. Rambo, Last Blood. Which, can I just say how awesome the name Last Blood is? So I actually don't know really what the consensus consensus on this movie is. I've heard a lot of people like it. I've also seen some people not like it. Um... I need to give it another watch. I think it's pretty good. Um, definitely like most of the other ones more, but I mean, yeah. Rambo. I need to definitely need to give it another watch. I remember watching the 4K stream of it, and it looked really good on the stream, so I can only imagine what the actual physical disc looks like. The Forever Purge. I haven't really been saying the prices, but I think you can see them up there. Nine ninety nine for this. The Forever Purge, which, like, like I said, they were 20% off, plus the buy three, get three free. So I got them for like... I don't know what they came out to, probably like five bucks a piece, something like that. So, maybe a little more than that. I have not seen The Forever Purge, and I have not seen The First Purge. I've seen The First Three, The First Purge, the movie called The First Purge. <laughs> um, seen The First Three, I like all three of them. They're not like my favorite movies or anything, but they're all pretty good, pretty entertaining. Even the first one, I know not, not a lot of people like the first one that much. The Call of the Wild. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to look, because I remember the trailers for this, and the CGI looked not the best. So I don't know how it's going to look on the 4K disc. Um, yeah. Rocket Man. I'm actually interested to watch this. I heard it was pretty good. And you get, like, this little booklet with it, which is cool. I'll just show it off here. This was $7.99. Well, actually, this is literally just like an expert of his autobiography, I think, or something like that. Still cool to have something extra, though. Um, so, yeah. And I think I made sure all these have Dolby Atmos tracks. I'm not 100% sure if I did or not. I kind of just assumed. But, yeah. And last but not least, we have Midway, which war movies seems like they would always be good with sound and, and 4 k So, yeah. But I have not, I have not seen that. Oh, I guess I could show this. I just bought this yesterday, I think. I seen it at Walmart. It was in like the three seventy four bin, three dollars and seventy four cents bin. The call. So I'll just throw this in this haul. Um, I think it's on like Amazon Prime, and I've seen it. it. I think it was one of those movies that went cheap, like shortly after it came out. I seen it like the five dollar bin, but um, I decided to just pick it up for whatever reason. So yeah, we got a nice, a very nice haul here. Do, 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 do. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Well, actually, this was from an unboxing I just did, so we're not going to count that one. But yeah. Ba so yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.